Architects review. Today we're going to show you a three story townhouse. It's three bedrooms, three baths, and it's 1500 square feet. So come on, let's go inside. Okay, so in the kitchen space, we've got the contemporary nice kitchen units. I think they're high gloss. Is it high gloss? It's like a satin finish as well. Yeah. You've got all your integrated appliances. And then there's this really nice glass splashback as well. I wonder if that comes with part of the deal or not, do you think? Yeah, I think um, they said that it comes with kit the kitchen fitted out as well. And then you've got this really nice stainless steel sink and this, uh, excuse me, <laughs> this, um, I think this is what's it, it's not Corian is it, but it's kind of like a, it's a solid surface worktop. Mm. Yeah. And it's all minimal, contemporary, everything kind of flush and hidden away. So what's the, what's the fridge? Yeah, yeah that's got to be the fridge. Let's have a look. Yep. I like it. Now, do you think there's a dishwasher in here? No. Um, I like this as well. I like it when every piece of every bit of space is used. Mm. It's nice. Yeah, really nice. And then obviously it's open plan, so you've got the living area here as well. I think it's really nice size. Everything is just so contemporary and modern. Like even the radiators, like kind of like panelled and slick. Okay. Yeah, and then the, obviously these large windows as well. And then the shadow gaps, instead of having typical architraves. Yeah, you've got nice detail there with shadow gaps. Yep, it's really nice. Okay, yeah. so yeah, let's go upstairs and see what's up. Sure. So this is the balcony and then we've got a really nice double bedroom, really nice. And take a look at the, the amazing ceiling height, it's just really, really nice. So tall. I buy your, your 5 foot 11? Yeah. It's really tall. I mean, look how tall it is. Look at me. It's like so tall. So this is a really nice space for a double bed. You have your wardrobes in that corner. And the doors as well are like, again, full height doors. So, but one of my favourite features about this type of, this home is these humongous windows. A full massive picture window. And then we've got the balcony as well. Can I have a look? So, obviously in the future, all of this is going to be developed. The 
going to have all these houses across all of this industrial site. It's going to look nothing like this. Let's Okay, let's go to the next room. Alright, so the corridor stage, this probably store. Yeah, this is where the hot water cylinder is. Take a look in there. Nice. Yeah. Again with the full height doors. So this is the bathroom. It's a nice size as well. It's got your shower bath as well. And I wonder if this is storage. Is this storage? I think this is decorative actually. Is this storage? I think it is, yeah. Can't see it. Oh, there you go. That's cool. So it's like really using the space. Ooh, nice. Yeah. That's a bad room. What's this? I didn't notice this. What's that? Ventilation system? Yeah, I thought you know, I think it's the mechanical ventilation. Which also has another balcony. As you can see, do you want to have a look at that for you? So. Okay, so this is the bedroom, the second bedroom, and it's basically similar in terms of the windows and the doors as the room at the front, got another big window and then another space, which you could probably put another double bed. But obviously it's been staged as a kid's room. That could definitely fit another double bed. And then, yeah, let's move to the next one. Again, an amazing detail of the slot window. that noise. Okay, so we've got the balcony space as well. It's huge and it goes all the way down there as well. Nice. Yeah. And this is the top wall. As you can see, it's really generous space. So this, what would you, what would you say this is, this space is? Another lounge? Probably another bedroom, really. Yeah, you could use as a bedroom or like an office, like a spin setup. Yeah. Hi guys, so we're on the top floor now and you can see another open plan space, which is staged as a lounge at the moment. Now, there's three main things that I love about this space. The first one being these amazing picture windows. The first one is a floor to ceiling window and the other one is just an amazing box window, which has kind of like a window seat to it as well. And then the second thing is this shadow gap detail, which you see throughout the whole house. But, you know, I just really love these shadow gaps around the windows instead of having your typical architraves. And then the third feature, which I love, is this vaulted ceiling which is just really dramatic and you can see this from outside the house actually in the roof so yeah those are my favorite things about this room of course and then the open plan concept continues down here as well and um, one thing about this house is that you're just never going to be short of natural light whatsoever. You've got three windows here, um, you've got a huge floor to ceiling and there's this element of being able to open them up. So that's quite unusual in England in the fact that there's a lot of balconies in this house as well. Um, so there's a lot of opportunity to have huge windows, you know. I just love just having floor to ceiling windows in the whole property and then having this detailing around the windows as well. So I think Brian, you showed just there, there was a wooden um, kind of detail, light wood. I don't know what type of wood it is, but it's 
<laughs> really nice. And then this would probably be the master. It's got the vaulted ceiling again. Um, it's very dramatic. And then we've got the ensuite, which is through here. And then before you get to the ensuite, you actually have like a dressing room area. So if this was me, I would have wardrobes on either side. Now it's an oversized shower with vaulted ceilings again. So the whole space has this vaulted ceiling and very, very tall doors. And um, so the ensuite obviously has the shower, your sink and your toilet. So yeah, so the best thing about this house is obviously it comes across like there's not that much detail but there actually is a lot of detail it's just very minimal and very contemporary you don't have your architraves and your coven details but you do have your shadow gaps and frameless details so one thing is that you know if you've really enjoyed this video we'd love you to subscribe thumbs it up and hit the bell notification so that you're notified when we upload our next video thank you bye